I wonder if I jump from here, will it break the game? Oh, you know? You know what they say. Maybe. Hello Internet, I am the final boss, and today we're going to be playing a game called Firewing 64. I saw this game and I thought, hey, I've got to gotta at least try it. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh no, the peace crystal has been shattered. You'll need to gather up all the fragments and fuse them back together in order to restore peace to the lands. That sounds like a pretty generic N64 plot. I saw the fragments of the shattered crystal scatter everywhere. As a warning, some of my greedy friends may have grabbed some, but I'm sure they will be willing to part ways with them for the right price. Oh, and be sure to watch out for those now hostile minis. What are, what's a mini? I know that the guy who made this game originally wanted to have a much bigger game. I, I read that on the Game Jolt page. But in order to complete it, he he uh, scaled it down to just one level that has a whole bunch of mini games and whatnot. I've seen a few people play this already, and it just it looks really good. Like the graphical style, it definitely go it does what it's going for, which is going for a uh, N64 game. Oh, whoa, whoa, I can just jump from here. What am I doing? Oh, I'm not sure if I'll make it. Oh, I made it. Awesome. Perfect. It's kind of a collect-a-thon type of deal. Uh, you probably have already figured that out. <laughs> but that's what's going on here. I need to go find some crystals and fuse them together to save the world. You know, N64 stuff. Yeah, you probably got a crystal, don't you? Activate this platform and it'll take you to the damp caves. Okay. Let's go to the damp caves. See what we get what's uh what what about what is at the damp caves? Oh, now it's a real it's a 2D platformer. That is interesting. Oh, that's really neat. Whoever it is that developed this game, I don't actually currently... Oh, I, there are health things. There are things of health to grab. You did a really good job at developing this game, whoever you are. I really appreciate this. Uh, the N64 was like more... Ooh, you almost got me. It, with the N64 was one of the first systems that I ever played. So seeing like a new modernist game in an N64 form is really nice. Another... Whoa! Whoa, I just zipped right off of there. I did not mean to do that. But seeing, like, uh, what, is, what is it? Ukulele? It's gonna be like a spiritual six. It's gonna be a spiritual successor to Banjo Kazooie. Whoa! I didn't think there was gonna be a crystal down here. I wonder how many crystals there are. Um, should I leave? I guess I'll go ahead and leave. What are you? This looks like it belongs to something with an engine. Oh, I was reading the description and there's some kart racing in this, so I guess I got to find all of the, uh, all of the engine parts? I don't really know. 350 gold. Crap. Uh, okay, so I got to find 350 gold pieces in order to buy one of the, uh, What's your McCallers? Ooh. What are you? Oh, apparently I can't. Oh, I just did. Yeah, see, there we go. That's the racing place. I, <laughs> apparently I can uh, do Mario-esque butt stomps. I, okay. Found myself another cave. And I might die down here because I only have the one health and I'm getting chased by some enemies, so that's great. Ah, I knew there was going to be something here. You don't just, like, set up a cave in an N64 game and <laughs> there's nothing in there. In Mario, there's always a star. In Torok, there was ammo and guns, etc., etc. No, oh, this is going to suck. Come on, collect the coins. Try not to die. Oh, whoa. You spit fire. Oh, no. Okay, so what does death mean? Diddly squat. Death means diddly squat. Okay, good to know. So I'm going to go ahead and continue up this hill. Because otherwise I'm going to have to just climb all the way back up to the top of the hill. Wings? 
Oh, hey, perfect. Another shard. And we're getting close to that 350. I mean, not really, but... Oh, we found the guy who wants the silver, too. So what... Could I... Whoa. Oh. It's like a power-up. Okay. I know what I need to do, then. I was gonna go talk to the... No! It doesn't last very long at all. Crap. Silver, guys. Let's see how many silver pieces I need. I'm gonna go with 10, probably, because it looks like... I know there's a few more left, and there's a few areas I haven't been to. But I assume that, seeing how the silver is a little bit more rare, that there aren't going to be very many silver coins. So let's go ask this guy. Are you coming out? Nah, okay, they have a really short attention span. What do you need? Yeah, it's pretty nice view. Yeah, well, can't disagree. I afford a view like this by accepting only coins of the platinum variety. If you have 10 of them, see, told you. I could trade you a blue crystal that I found. All right, uh, I will uh, grab those coins for you and I will be back. Now, let's try and shoot on over to here. I can only assume that this, these specific wings are the reason why you come over here. Because it doesn't look like there's, one, there's any other way to come over here. Two, why can't I fly in the first place? I'm a dragon. Um, just to, that's just something that was bothering me a little bit. What is all the way back here? Ooh, man. Coins. I do need a bunch more of those. About 148. Ex well, exactly 148. Who, who, what am I talking about? All right, let's go ahead and get up here. Yeah, you can't hit me. Oh, there's a new area. So that's nice. I don't know what this area is going to end up taking me to. I would appreciate knowing, but... Okay, it looks like we're going to have to go ahead and get those wings. Oh, no! We're going to have to get those wings again in order to go to those areas. And it looks like those areas have coins. Alright, we'll go ahead and do some racing. And then I guess I'm going to have to fly around a little bit. I mean... I know there's those two islands that should have a bunch of coins on them. And then... This racetrack, honestly, will probably have some coins on them. There might even be a secret here, I don't know. These parts have been abandoned for a while, so I'm not sure if that cart, stair, that cart there still works or not. I mean, I found a cart for it. Or I found a part for it. Hey, I did only need that one. I don't know how to drive. Is it attack? No. Okay. Oh, you really pulled to the left. Whoa. It has a. It does have a very Mario Kart -y feel, honestly. Let's go ahead and finish up this race, I suppose. This is probably just for like bragging rights on Game Jolt, to be honest. This is probably just gonna go on to some record or something. Yeah, I don't see any like coins or anything here. I thought there'd be some coins. Whoa, avoid the oil slicks, that's for sure. Even though they don't really do much to do anything. Oh, okay, so if I finish it, I get a... The cart was still going. Cool. So I got another another one of those. Oh, that's... The boxes that... Some of the boxes have stuff in them. I was not aware. Ah, <laughs> oh, now I gotta go back through and go all, all of the boxes. Okay. Alright, anyway. Yeah, you love gold. I got some gold. Deal? Hey, nice. There goes all my coins, but I ended up getting another crystal shard thingy. What if I... Okay. Not sure why we're uh, we're applauding this type of destructive behavior, but you know, I, I I can't complain that much. Hopefully, I'll get lucky, and this has the silver coin in it somewhere. I really hope so, because otherwise, I don't know where to find it. It did. Okay, perfect. Buy what I need from this guy. 
Yep, blah, 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 I did gotcha. I can and I just did. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, deal's deal. Let's get on with this. Okay, so now I've got all nine of the crystals and I just gotta fuse them together. D to do that, I've gotta go to the Crystal Island. And... Yeah, that's basically it. No! Okay. Whew. That was stressful. I honestly thought that I was gonna have to like climb the mountain again. And it's, it's just time consuming at this point. Or, okay, so now we have all nine crystals. We gotta play a game of Simon. We gotta play a game of Simon in order to do it, it looks like. Yeah. Literally just a game of Simon. What? Wait, no, seriously, what? Hey! All I had to do is probably annoy the crap out of you guys by talking and saying nothing but colors, but hey, we fixed it. I have completed a great game and proved the justice of the peace crystal. Now go and rest our heroes. I will, go, I will rest all of our heroes. To those thinking that I am illiterate, look up the ending to Ghostbusters on the NES. Oh, okay. Let's jump to restart, and that should bring us to the end of the game. If that might be credits. I don't know if... Oh, no, it looks like the game's going to crash. So, we got that going for us. Uh, I, I'll just go ahead and do the ending then. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Subscribe for more great indie games, and I will see you in the next video.